Hey friends, I'm Simple Cheeks and welcome back to another Speed Build. Happy Sunday and hopefully you're having a great day so far. Today we're back building for my simple save file which is a base game compatible save file that I have been working on for months and this time we're building in Oasis Springs. So this build is actually the very first build that we're doing for this world for my save file and this home is for Johnny Zest. So this is his trailer home and we're currently building it in a 20 by 15 lot that is called Nookstone. Johnny Zest originally lives in a different lot within the same neighborhood but I forgot the name of the lot but I, I think it was a 40 by 30 lot and I just don't know how to fill that lot for just one sim. I didn't want to fill in the spaces with just landscapes so I decided to move him into a smaller lot. I just felt the lot, the original lot was too big for him so and I just imagined that he doesn't have much items to begin with so I think a smaller home in a smaller lot would fit him better and um, for the 40 by 30 lot I was kind of imagining maybe um, sorry my, my, my throat is itching but I'm just gonna continue this voiceover because I have been trying to record this voiceover for three times now so I'm just gonna go with it but anyway um, for the 40 by 30 lot I was imagining that I want a bigger family living there so maybe a family trailer home or like a compound for trailer houses I'm not sure I'm not sure yet but that's that's my initial idea but what I'm currently sure of is that for this neighborhood I want all the houses to be trailer homes so um, that's what I have decided but anyway I'm sure you all probably know the lore behind Johnny Zest by now but in case not Johnny Zest is actually a land grab and Johnny Zest is just his screen name. He was disowned by the land grabs and he was said to be the eldest kid of Nancy and Joffrey Landgrab so he he's actually um, the brother of Malcolm. So Johnny Zest was disowned after dropping out of school to follow his dream of becoming an entertainer. Um, the disowning aspect, I kind of feel like that decision came from Nancy. I don't know about you guys but the way I see Nancy or my perception about her is that she really gives that mean or evil vibe so I kind of feel like um, it was her decision to disown uh, Johnny Zest and that uh, I, I see her as the alpha within the family so I think uh, she's the one who calls the shots or makes the decision within the family so yeah I think I think it was her decision so and I think I, I think Joffrey I see Joffrey as a really nice guy so I think maybe he's still in contact with Johnny but I'm not sure I don't know about you guys what do you think about that story but I feel like that's uh, the story that I want to go with for my save file so I'm gonna make that uh, happen but anyway we're now currently wrapping up the landscaping for this house I kept it minimal it's not overgrown I just wanted the landscape to feel like the plants were naturally there or it just naturally grown within the perimeter of the lot and we just kept the side yard simple we just um, put some plants and then there's a, an outdoor seating area where Johnny can hang out with a friend 
and grill some barbecue. And then for the interior, I try to keep in mind that he's still a land grab. Um, he just doesn't have that much budget, but he's still a land grab. I imagine um, that in the land grab mansion, they keep things, but, uh, things very well put together or everything is tidy um, with nicer furniture. And I, I kind of feel like that's something that Johnny Zest would inherit. So I kept um, his home or I, I decorated his home with that thought. So I tried to make it look cheap since um, he's just starting with his career. But I tried to make it look tidy, a bit tidy and well put together. And I just imagine that he has both his furniture little by little or when he earned money from work he would buy little decorations to put around his home and yeah i guess that that was my idea behind um the decorations for this house but anyway we're now in the living room and i gave him this um stereo and i put stacks of cds on top of it and i just imagined that it was uh recordings of uh, maybe some comedy uh shows from uh, different artists that he looks up to and he's trying to study their ways for him to become a better comedian. Um, John Zest is a, an, an ambitious sim so I, I kind of feel like that's that really fits um, his personality because I, I feel like he's really trying his best to come up the ladder of the entertainer career so he's doing all this little efforts to really up his game with his comedy so he's um, reading books uh, he's watching uh, comedy shows and he's just trying to learn as much as he can so that he can be better at his job so that was my idea and then for the kitchen, we just kept it very simple and minimal. I just put here a table with two chairs. So since he's living alone, uh, I decided to just, just give him a smaller table. And then maybe if he invited a friend over, they can eat together in this kitchen. So... Um, for the, and then for this bathroom, this is just my typical 2x3 bathroom and uh, I put this hamper here and then I put a laundry basket on top of it and then uh, I was trying to fit that plant but I kind of feel like it doesn't fit the vibe of this bathroom and then I just decorated it um, uh, the best that I could uh, and then uh, this style is the same as the one in the kitchen and then we're moving a bit into the bedroom the bedroom is minimally decorated I just used um, the cheapest double bed from base game and I used this brown swatch and then since it's a little cramp in this bedroom i just gave him this standing uh, lampshade and then here on the wall i i gave him this um art that is like a cutout from a magazine and it has this blondie in the cover i was thinking maybe it's nancy so um i feel like Johnny Zest still loves his family and he, he still keeps track of how his family is. So I kind of feel like uh, maybe in the future they will they would um, be reunited together or at least with his brother or his father. But um, that's just 
my initial thought but anyway we're now on the screenshots so if you want to download this build it's it's already up in the sims 4 gallery my id is simple cheeks which is the same as my youtube handle and everywhere else you can also find it under the hashtag simple cheeks if you want to download the tray files, they are completely free and they are linked in the description box below. Thank you so much for watching and we I wish you all a wonderful weekend. Let's talk again on my next video. Bye bye!